What we see here is a demo of simultaneous localization and mapping. So the goal is to find where the camera is with respect to the environment. And while the camera is moving, we are building a representation of the environment that allows us to find where the camera is with that environment. In addition to that, we are having some augmented character um, on the live video. This is now since say three, four years is quite standard in the computer vision in the augmented reality field. But since the value of the uh, Kinect, what we are able to get in addition to this is the depth map which basically gives to every pixel in the image um, depth, its depth value and we are using this not for gesture recognition as it's meant to be for the usage in the clinic but we are using it to build a dense uh, version of the environment and this dense version of the environment not only helps to get a better tracking and localization of the camera but also allows us to handle correctly the occlusion. What we can see here is that if we do not handle occlusion then the augmentation doesn't look realistic but because this environment, because the environment is getting built while we are moving the camera we are able to handle occlusion or at least to have a better uh, display of the augmentation in the line. So here the book is correctly um, including the virtual object, so there is not any more just virtual objects on top of the live video, but the real objects are hiding the virtual one, so there is kind of interaction between the virtual and the real.